Hi guys, it's me Chloe and I'm back with another video and this video is going to be a bit different to the others because obviously it's not going to actually be a video well it is but just with no camera on so hence my voice and I'm going to put some photos in of what I'm going to talk about today which is the HIV and AIDS crisis sort of thing so obviously this is a really big thing at the end, like late seventies, eighties. Don't necessarily know which 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 one to be honest, but obviously a famous person who passed away, obviously of AIDS, is the legendary Freddie Mercury, which I'm gonna put a quote of him that I love now. Um. I just love him, I love Queen and everything and he went way too soon and he's such a good advocate and support and idol for people who are part of the LGBT community um, and then obviously just gays in general because everyone thought oh, it was a gay disease that only gay men got it um, and that it would be contacted by like even the smallest of things like ho touching them which is so stupid but um now obviously times have changed now and there's like medication and a cure like not really cure but medication to help it and um, now and i love the the tv show i'm going to mention it's the same that f featured ollie alexander from years and years he was the lead um role uh, um character called richie and he was amazing he was a gay man in the time of the AIDS crisis and ended up obviously dying of AIDS. Well, it was HIV that led, led to AIDS, which was quite sad to be honest. Um, but it's nice. It was a, a nice message, I think, to explain like how bad it was then, and how um to the the next generations who like wouldn't have known about it. So, for example, like my generation. Um, so I really liked it, and obviously he is got HIV in real life himself and on medication for it. So I feel like they've made the role for him, which I thought was really great and standard for him. And um, I love the show so much, and I thought it was really good rep representation, cast, all that. It was sad though, and um, but yeah, um. So if you haven't watched it, it's a sin. Try and watch it. I think it was ITV. So it might be on ITVX if you search it somewhere. I don't think it was on BBC. I think it was definitely on ITV. Um, but don't quote me on it. And um, but yeah, just like how bad it was back then. You know, like I read, uh, I got a book on um, Queen because obviously I love Queen, and um, how bad it, it affected people. Like Freddie nearly lost, like literally lost a foot over his how bad the AIDS affected him because he literally had what was a little left of a foot of it because it just affected his feet which i didn't know was a thing but it did and then obviously the coffin of blood sort of thing which was like i think one of the main signs that everyone knows but then there was some subtle signs that neither one knew and um yeah i just wanted to say that um because like the, the whole point of me doing this channel is to speak my opinions and my views of subjects like that I want to give advice on that aren't properly understood or brushed under the carpet per se because they don't feel comfortable talking about it because it's like a taboo subject and it's too difficult to talk about I'm not gonna be like that this is what this channel's for to give advice about any and all things that I I will do my research yes i'm not professional but i will do research and just give my opinion on anything and anything and everything and do a video on it because i don't think there's anything wrong with that and um obviously i'm a big big advocate for the lgbt community as i'm part of it myself i am a proud pansexual gender fluid demi romantic asexual woman <laughs> I know that sounded like one, two, three, four, like literally listing everything, but trust me, um it's took a long time for me to get here. Um to the still be right way, but um I wouldn't change it for the world. Um I love who I am and who I love and what I am for my sexuality, for my agenda, for my autism, for my mental health, I love all of it. And that's also what big thing on my channel, like 
giving advice and promoting like mental health and body positivity not body positivity acceptance more um and like you don't have to be, have a way, look a certain way to be feel pretty and beautiful um like you can love yourself for all the insecurities and not let them get to you and yeah um I'm gonna stop rounding now because I've went off subject once again um but yeah um I hope you um liked this video um please um obviously like the video if you liked it um subscribe turn on the notification bells uh bell so you're not missing a future video of mine and yeah I think that's all I can say for this week um yeah I've been Chloe bye peace